श्री सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरी गोष्ठीपति वंदे गुरुपद दंदम भक्त बिंद श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन समयुक्त बिंदन मनोहर वाछा कल्पतरुवश्च के पास इंदुभवच पतिता पावने वैष्णवभ्यो नमो नम मुखंकोतिवाचाल पंगुंगिरी यत्की पातमहंग वंदे परमानंदमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्तिपदेवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरुंच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरी पत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदरुण ध्येय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदूहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरिंचनुत शरण्यम वेत्तिहम पुनुतपालीपूत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणारिंद यत्दपल्लवनखचंदमनीछटाय विस्फुरजीतकमुवधुषुदर्शि पूर्णागरसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामय कदा कृपा श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनेतानंद श्रीअदगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बुदा तो संकर्तन कपितरो कमलायथाक्ष भीशाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंदो दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दिनी भावान्ूपेन सदा नरान गंगातरंगरमणीयटाकलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषित बाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंगमदारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ वागीशुषने लक्ष्मीजश च भक्षसी जैस्यास्ते संबीत सिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 
गुरुदम ग्रंथदम नामदम धामदम मुदा भक्तिदम भूरिदम बंदे भक्ति विनोदक सदा गुरुदम ग्रंथदम नामदम धामदम मुदा भक्तिदम भूरिदम बंदे भक्ति विनोदक सदा गौड़ीय गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी भोपाल परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट श्री सच्चिदानंद भक्ति ठाकुर हैज गिवन अस एवरीथिंग टॉप टू बॉटम एवरीथिंग भक्ति ठाकुर हैज गिवन टू अस ओनली वी हैव टू फॉलो अंडर द गाइडेंस ऑफ योर गुरु वैष्णव गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी भोपाल परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट आवर शिल सच्चिदानंद भक्ति ठाकुर ही हैज गिवन एवरीथिंग टू अस टॉप टू बॉटम एवरीथिंग ओनली वी विल हैव टू कीप पेशेंसी वी विल हैव टू फॉलो हिम अंडर द गाइडेंस ऑफ शुद्ध गुरु वैष्णव What do you mean by top to bottom? Top to bottom mean even those who like to enter into Gauri Bhajan, even those who like to enter into Gauri Bhajan. Preliminary instruction. From there, up to the end point, Radha Dasho. What not given? One day, Prabhupada was sitting. I have already written an article. Prabhupada was sitting inside his bhajan kutir, looking outside garden through the window. But Paramananda Babu already given prasadam, noon time prasadam, and gone for some other seva. After forty forty minutes, forty five minutes. He come back and watching Prabhupada not touching even prasadam, looking something looking outside garden through window. Parvana was stunned. Never before this kind of thing happened. Prabhupada, you have not taken prasadam as yet. What you are looking outside? What is there? Prabhupada with harsh voice, I am looking how you are going to destroy your golden opportunity, how you are going to burn up your luck, all your luck burn up. That I am looking. I am looking how you are going to burn up your luck. There is very golden opportunity there. I was looking. Like Jodu Bangsa, Jodu Bangsa can never be destroyed by anybody. In Simad Bhagavatam, it is written, Jodu Bangsa can never be never be destroyed by anybody. Only and only Krishna, if one, if Krishna wants so, can withdraw. Popat with strong mood, heavy. Heavy heart speaking, they like to get destroyed like Yodu Bangsa. They can fight among themselves. They have no power to deliver outside people, fallen soul. They can make fool of them. That they can do. That much capacity they have. How to make fool of them? How to collect that they know. But they cannot deliver themselves. Even they cannot deliver themselves. What to speak about others? That this way, all is infighting. All is infighting. This way, they like to get destroyed. The eternal parsat of Sila, the eternal parsat of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. 
who has given us guru, some idiot personalities out of jealousy, they are, come, they are passing very dirty remark about Prabhupada. We are going to give fitting answer to them. We are going to give fitting and that is called, that is called, actually, bhajan. That is called actually bhajan. When Bhakti Minutaku writing this, so many people, they are criticizing. Bhakti Minutaku writing, Saraswati Krishna Priya, Krishna Bhakti Jahar Hiya, Bino de Rosei We are grateful unto our lotus feet of Sila Sachidanga Bhakti Minu Thakur. I am not, not only I am, Gauranga Mapu also ever grateful to Bhakti Minu Thakur. Because Bhakti Minu Thakur is going to express some opulences. Vaibhav. That Bani Vaibhav coming in the form of. Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami. Jadi gaur na hoi to, tabi ki hoi to, kemane dhari taam deho. We are doing kirtan. Jali satchidanda bhakti vino thakun nahi hoi to. Then how? How we could identify ourselves as the gauriya devotee? We have no power to go through all the writings of Goswami. Very critical. All Sandarbha, this, that, Vedanta. Bhakti Mantra is going to, going to get the cream out of that. You need not give energy. I am giving energy, you just try to avail this opportunity. But that you cannot do. So lazy. So lazy. Whole Vaishnava Samaj are crippled. Crippled. That you are a paralytic patient. Nobody feeling power to protest against wrong Siddhanta. Nothing speaking. They like to protect their own self. Because they know if I am going to speak, they, they can make us naked. People can know. Better we can. It's very good. We can identify with ourselves as a great devotee, not speaking anything to anybody. At the same time, can love puja patishtha. Uh, both ways. Both ways we are going to benefit. This is more practical. This way. So, Gurudam, we are getting Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Gosai. Actually, like Adyaita Gosai, Adyaita Gosai inviting Advaita Gosai inviting Parat Parakilya say, Krishna, you come, you come. You will have to come. Then, by the prayer of Advaita Gosai, Bhagavan Sri Krishna coming, I mean Gauranga coming. By the prayer of Bhaktivinoda Thakur, we are getting Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. In fact, in fact, he wanted to pray unto a lotus feet of Bimala, Bimala Devi. Inside Jagannath Mandi, Chit Shakti, Sarup Shakti. He is going to pray for a long time unto a little sweet of Bimala Devi. Please, you do something. You do something. And he already wrote Kirtan, you know, Kula Devi, Jogumaya, Morikipa Kuri, Abaram Sangbiri Be, Tumi Vishadhuri. Sunachi Agam Bede Mahima Tumar, Sikishna Bimuke Dhuri Karao Sangsar, Sikishna Sanmuk Kojar Bhagokome Hoy, Tare Mukti Diakoro Osakohoi. By the prayer of Bhaktivinu Thakur, we are getting Bhakti Shidhan to Saraswati Gusam Who is going to shake the whole world? Who was successful to shake the whole world? He wanted to do something, but we are undoing. He wanted to do, but we wanted to undo. We are undoing. We are not preaching. Preaching can only be done. May repeatedly I told, repeatedly I told, sitting in Vyasasana, 
Preaching can only be possible under the guidance of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur, the Prabhupada. Preaching can be possible. Those who are not following Srila Prabhupada only like to make fool of us by arranging some external festival. Jai Prabhupada, Jai Prabhupada. They cannot get any facility. Never. So, he is going to give us Guru. He is going to give more than 100 I heard directly from right, from right source. He wrote more than 100 books. But we are not getting. All destroyed or somebody wanted to hide, I don't know. We are not getting 100 books. Hundreds of books. 100 books here. More than 100. Gurudam, Gantadam, Namadam. He wanted to teach us how to do Harinam. What is the procedure? He wanted to show us the scientific procedure by writing Harinam Chintamani, the most scientific books. He himself wanted to do Harinam all day and night. So Namadam means he wanted to give us the way through which we can do. Because Namadam means Nam is eternally present. Krishna is eternally present, but who can give? Krishna is eternally present. So what? Krishna is eternally present. But some, somebody has to give ma. Gurudev can give Krishna to. Krishna said, Tomar Krishna dite paro. Krishna said, Tomar Krishna dite paro. Tomar shakti aja. The Krishna and Harinam also. It is only Sachidananda Bhakti Mithaku who wrote, Nam bina kichu nahi ko aro, Chodda bhuvano maaje, Krishna nam shudha kori apan, Jurao bhakoti vinodo pran. Bhakti Mithaku writes, Bhakti Mithaku writes, Showing us that if you look everywhere, what you are doing? He is enemy. He is doing this. He is doing this. Who is doing this? And what you are doing? What you are doing? Bhakti Mahatma would say, everywhere Harinam. Whenever you look, you can say Harinam. Harinam you can say, Nam Prabhu. Scientific Siddhanta. 100%. Nam bina kuchu nahi ku aro chaudda bhuvana maji. Except Harinam, I cannot see anything. Everywhere Harinam. That is the, that is the Golog darshan of Srila Satchidandu. Because Nam bina kuchu nahi ku aro mean, I cannot see anything except Nam. Nam mean Radha Govindu. Same thing, those who are doing Ram Bhajan, they are speaking. They are not this way, a little bit different because they are receiving Ram. They are watching Ram everywhere. Sita Ram. Sita Ram Mai Sabu Jagu Jani Karhupanam Juri Jogu Pani. Siya Ram Mai Sab Jag Jani. Tulsi Dasi writing. Everywhere we can see Sita Ram. Uh, we are watching everywhere Radha Govinda, Gauranga. What you are watching? From starting to end, even those who like to get entry into Gauriya Bhajan, for them, how much merciful Bhakti Muttaku. From the starting to end, end means Radha Daswa, everything. Guru Padma used to say, My son, you will have to read Jaiva Dharma, if not more, 108 times. Then you can know everything, what not there. Everything, all just you can get, all answer. 
everything. Chaitanya Sekhamito, Mahaprabhu Shiksha, Bhajan Rasya, Harinam Chintapani, Jaiva Dharma, Prem Pradip, all. Bhagavad Arka Marichi Mala, Godadar Pandit came in dream. You write some book very easily because everybody cannot go to 18,000 slok Bhagavatam. So why not to do something so that common man can get the gist of Bhagavatam? Well, I can do. By the order of Godadar Pandit, he wrote Bhagavat Arka Marichi Mala by very nice segregation. Shamanda, Abhidya and Prajna. Samanda, Abhidya and Prajna. So nice. Bhagavad Arka Marichimala. If I go through Bhagavad Arka Marichimala under the guidance of pure good, I can get the result of reading whole Bhagavatam. Really bad luck. Really bad luck. After getting this kind of facility, golden opportunity, still we cannot avail this opportunity. Some of us, are, some of us become sahajiya, some of become wayward devotees, some of antagonists. All this is our status at present. Very painful situation. Bharbali, we can say. Bharwali, we can say, we support Bhakti Minutaku. But what Bhakti Minutaku told, you are following? Are you following? I can show you. You are not following. Maybe you have money power. You can try to kill me. But absolute is absolute. Whole world is going to leave me, still I cannot. Everybody cannot digest absolute truth. You need some capacity. But Prabhupada speaking, absolute truth can be there. Some devotee, like Bhakti Minutaku, they are singing, but not that everybody can digest. Absolute truth can be there, but everybody cannot digest. Some of them are very, are very few. Not that. Sila Sachidanda Bhakti Minutaku told that to run a spiritual organization, especially a devotional organization, we need devotees, those who are in renounced order. But that doesn't mean we can bring everybody and give red cloth and blue cloth and yellow cloth, white cloth, and make a dustbin. Komot, Guru Mahat, you say, Komot. Oh, we have 500 devotees in our temple. Eh? You have 500 devotees. I challenge you. You can show one devotee. You have no power to proclaim that we have 500 devotees there in our temple. 500? One devotee I like to see. One devotee. Or even you can prove you are, you are yourself devotee. Otherwise, how you can pass this kind of dirty remarks? There is a symptom. You can make full of world. You cannot make full of Prabhupada, Guru Varga. You cannot make full of us. Let people go and die there. Let them sacrifice their life there unto the lotus feet of those cheaters. Let them do. What we can do? We can cry. We can cry. We have nothing to do. We can repent. Nothing to do. Srila Sachyanda Bhakti Minutaku speaking. To run one devotional organization, we need devotees, those who are in renounce. That's okay. But that doesn't mean we can bring all garbage and put inside. Whereas Bhakti Minutaku wanted to identify himself as a cleaner of that garbage, sweeper. You are just going to, he wanted to do, but you are undoing. He wanted to throw all garbage from Namhata. You are going to bring all garbage and throw into Namhatta. What do you mean by Namhatta? Where Priyo, Harikatha, Kirtan, all is going on. Pure Sadhu going to show their acharan, fire, like. That is called Namhatta. Where Nityananda, Gauranga, all is present. 
you are going to make namhatta dirty. You are going to make tam namhatta dirty. But Bhakti Muntagur, Papa speaking, Bhakti Muntagur wanted to identify himself as a sweeper of namhatta. What? The throw outside. Throw outside all garbage. Why you are bringing garbage? In the name of love, puja, patishta, money, position, uh, collecting money, you are going to bring garbage. You yourself already confessed. You confess that you are bring, going to bring garbage. But I think realization is not there. Or maybe you are in dilemma. Something you are realizing, but you have no power to come back again. Those who are doing criminal activities, na, sometime they are thinking, I have done wrong, it's not good. But still, they are reaching up to that point, such a point, they have no power to come back again. Some criminal mafia, they are this underground wall, if you enter them, very easy. If you come back, you cannot come back. They can kill you. They, you can enter. Money, position, love, they can. But you have no power to come back. You cannot come back. There is a situation. Bhakti was speaking, by watching all those rabbis' activities, by watching all those rabbis' activities inside your temple, activities of the brahmacharya and sannyasis, outside people are going to spit on your head. Poo! Bhakti Mantra writing. They are going to spit on you. Foolish, they can worship you, but those who are devotees cannot worship you. Even outside world, they are not going to spit. Even legal procedure, everything, those who are the common people now spitting on them. Police department, everything, all. They are spitting on them. All corrupted. Devotional feel more corrupted. More, why say? Because he is absolute. we should reach absolute, absolute problem. Why I say? Because those who are nonsense, they are common people, they have no idea. They can do. But how you are doing? After getting so much information, so much support you are doing, that's why I say more. Follow. More. Here is the condition. Bhakti Mantra speaking, common people can spit on them. And by setting, and by setting this kind of organization or temple or anything, ashram, by the help of this fallen soul in the form of red cloth or white cloth or sannyas, acharya, you cannot establish any ideal idealism of Gauranga Map. Any way we cannot, any way you cannot establish the idealism. I challenge you, you cannot do it. You know yourself what to speak of fighting. As per our Guru Bharga, those who are cleaning, those who are cleaning, cleaning the corridor of Gauriyamat, all temple. Those who are cleaning the barshan, utensil, follow. Those who are worshipping, those who are cooking, all they are preacher. They are all preacher. How? We never heard. New, we are thinking new. No new. Nothing new. Maybe you never wanted to hear from Guru Bhargava. That's why your condition is bad. All they are preachers. Those who are cleaning temple, those who are cleaning latrine, bathroom, all they are preachers. By their ideal character, those who are visiting Gauriyamat, they are watching their... They are watching. But they are sober character, so nice. They can feel reaction. All they are passive preacher. Those who are cooking, those who are cleaning utensil, those who are, you know, cleaning Gauri Mart, you know, all temple, they are all passive preacher. Not active preacher, but passive. By watching them, 
their acharan, their devotion, with loveful mood they are clearing temple. They are not servicemen like you. That you can pay 10,000 to Brahmachari and uh, 50,000 to sannyasis. Business organization. For infinity period, you will have to go away from the absolute truth. You cannot. Some important personality, important in the sense according to the estimation of material people, very important, is requesting Bhakti Muni Thakur. Thakur, why you are putting so much restriction? Everybody should be allowed. Everybody should be allowed into Gauriya. What problem in it? And finally, survival of the fittest can be applied, this formula. Survival of the fittest. This formula can be applied. Everybody, why so restriction? Why allow everybody? They can enter into Gauriya. Bhakti Mahatma said, no, not so easy. We cannot use all idiot people to enter. The garbage, we cannot invite garbage. No, we cannot allow this bimal, pure teachings, very, very absolute teachings of Gauriam, Gauranga Mahaprabhu. We cannot allow the absolute teachings of Gauranga Mahaprabhu to be contaminated by those Rabbis people. I cannot allow them. I can check them. Hey, what? Like, you know, airport or anywhere you enter, because they check up. Like Jagannath, if you check up, they say, you have any, you should check up. But you are not acting as Acharya. I can come to the point, very important point. Maybe whole world can go against me, but I will have to speak. The situation is very critical. Very, very critical. Nobody likes to pay attention. Bhakti Mahatma was speaking, no, we cannot allow the absolute idealism of Gauranga Mahapu to be contaminated by those rubbish people. We cannot allow them inside Gauriya Mahat. We cannot allow them inside Gauriya Mahat. We cannot allow them to enter into Goryamat. Before that, we can check. That's the same thing Bhakti Muni Thakur write, but you are just doing opposite. Like legal personality, I can prove everything. Bhakti Muni Thakur wrote in Kirtan, Sarvasya tomar charone shopiya Parichi tomaro ghare Tumi to thakuro, tomaro kukuro, boliya jano ho more. Badhiya nikothe amare palive, rohibo tomaro dare. Pratipa janere asite na divo, rakhibo gare ro pare. What speaking? Bhakti Mantra speaking. Bhakti himself singing, I cannot allow everybody to enter. They can disturb you. No. I am dog. You get. If somebody, Pratip, antagonist coming, go, go, go. Like dog spewing. Bhakti Mantra speaking. Pratip or Jane, those are antagonists. I cannot allow them to enter. Go, Yama. No. But you are doing just opposite. With Chaitanya Bhagavad, there meant Chaitanya Mahaprabhu himself. I am so confident to speak this. You are doing just opposite of what Bhakti Muni Thakur told. So you have no right to worship Bhakti Muni Thakur. No right. Of course, your worshiping has some inner meaning. You like to get some pratishta. You like to exhibit that I have. Love for Bhakti Mantra. But I can prove eh, no love. No smell of love. The symptom of love is that you will have to follow Bhakti Mantra. Not that Barbali I can say I love Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. Each and every of my activities, all my writings, 
speeches, everything can prove. I am going to take life risks. I am going to take life risks. I know, but still I am speaking. Of course, background is background is okay. Background, I make ready by the mercy of Bhagavan. No problem. I don't fear. So Bhakti Mohan Tagore writing this way, and you are just doing opposite. Those who are not qualified to enter into Goryaman, you are giving the sannyas. Because you have no sannyas. You are giving sannyas to them because you have no sannyas. What you say, I don't understand. You don't understand the inner meaning. You are giving sannyas. You are giving sannyas because they become satisfied with the sannyas and they cannot point out that you have no sannyas. Mutual understanding. Mutual understanding. If I have no sannyas, I have no right to give sannyas to anybody. No sannyas. By giving everything. This way, you are going to make all dirty, all namhatta. Because it is more practical for you. If you are not going to contaminate this world, uh, contaminate this namhatta, otherwise, you would be caught by somebody. So it's better to make the common platform. We can naked dance, we can do. Make it common pla flat platform. Flat, all flat. No up down, it's uh, not Vaishnav. Or we can make a flat platform, uh, naked dance, everybody can. Common platform. It's more practical. Bhakti Murata was speaking, better I can keep my Goshala vacant than to get than to allow any wicked cow to enter here. Dushto Guru take a shunno gual valo. Bhakti Mata was speaking, it is far better to keep the Goshala vacant than to allow all wicked cows to enter. It's more practical. But you are not doing it. Bhakti Mata, I can show you you can open Bhakti Vinod Bani Bhai Bhav, you can open Jaiva Dharma, you can open, uh, you know, you can open all Mahaprabhu Siksha or Sri Chaitanya, I can show you. What Bhakti Vinod Thakur writing? I can show you. They are Bhakti Vinod Thakur writing in article also. In article also. How many articles you like to see? I can show you. An article Bhakti Mata Tagore writing in all writings. It is the it is the most vital duty. It is the most vital duty of those acharyas, those who are taking the leading part in our devotional society. It is their mo the most important duty, responsibility to rectify this situation, rectify the situation, rectify Siddhanta Vichar, protest those who are going to speak against Guru Varga, protest against those who are going to make a distorted form of pure devotion, try to protest. It is a main duty. If they are not going to show their ideal character and behavior, then what our whole society can do? In article Bhakti Mitra writing. Bhakti Mitra Thakur, 150 years back, 150 years back, or more than that, Bhakti Mitra Thakur, he wanted to express concern. He wanted to express concern about the situation going to build up. I mean, he could see 150 years back, 150 years after what going to happen, he could see. So, he wanted to give us some warning. I would request everybody, all devotees all over the world, to go through Chaitanya Shikshamitra, Chaitanya Bhagavat, Mahaprabhu Shiksha, Jaiva Dharma, 
Harinam Chintabani, all different articles, so that at least they can discover that our Gurudev wanted to misguide us that much. I don't need any facility. I don't need any facility, I promise you. You like to do some seva, yes, okay. Forcefully not. At least you can discover. This life you cannot do bhajan. This life you can because you are under the guidance of false guru. That's okay. At least you can discover you are from top to bottom, you are misguided. That at least you can understand. And if you have power, that much honesty and purity, then you can take the right track. But I think you cannot do. You have some biasness, some color, political color, everything color is there. Is a, you cannot do. We should remember Bhaktivinoda Thakur before taking Diksha. Even before taking Diksha, Bhaktivinoda Thakur wrote so many books. It is impossible. It is impossible. Because if after taking Diksha, somebody can get Guru Kipa, they can write. But Bhakti Mithagur, much before, wrote so many things. Kirtan, so many things he wrote. Some devotee in Purushottam Dham wanted to complain against him. Who is he to speak this Siddhanta Harikatha? He himself is not initiated. No Tilakmala, nothing. He is speaking. Some devotee is complaining against Bhakti Mantra. Bhakti Mantra, never mind. But overnight, he discovered his bhajan gone. Bhajan gone. He will become like material man. Huh? What happens? My bhajan all gone? Oh, maybe I criticize Bhakti Mantra. Bhakti Mantra, that, that time his name, his name was not Bhakti Mantra. That time he was Kedarnath Dattva. Kedarnath Dattva. Then he come, run, come. Oh, I have done some mistake and your lotus feet. I told you are not initiated this, that. Why you are speaking this way? Bhakti Mantra was laughing. He, really you are so. Still today, I am searching Sadhguru. I'm not getting. So you are right. Bhakti Mantra, out of his humble attitude, speaking this. But that sadhu could realize he is the eternal parsad of Mahaprabhu. Automatically he could realize. Eternal parsad. Kobi Karnapur need not take any initiation from anybody. Srila Sachidananda Bhakti Mantra need not take any initiation. Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami need not take any initiation. Automatically they can do. But still, they are manifesting this kind of lila so that, that the bhajan tracks should be organized. That's why Bhagavan Sikh is also taking initiation. Ramchandra taking initiation from Ashtabhakka Muni. Bhagavan Gauranga, he is also taking initiation. Where he is not doing, then, oh, he never took. So what? What problem? No need. So, Gorang Mapu, like devotee, showing everything. He took initiation. It is one kind of Leela. He took initiation. Some such a sort, from such a sort, which was proved to be <coughs> which was proved to be not authentic. <coughs> Bhakti Mantra himself could realize. Not only that, but also our <coughs> Prabhupada told, when he wanted to criticize Raghunath Das Goswami, hey, Raghunath Das Goswami is from a low caste. I am from a high Brahmari caste. Then Prabhupada told, Thakur, you leave him. He is actually antagonist. He is passenger. He leave him. He wanted to criticize. Whom? Raghunath Das Goswami. And Bhakti Mantra wrote, that writing is there with me in Gauriya. 
Bhakti Mahatma wrote, well, that Guru was there. That Guru was there. Because Bhakti Mahatma wrote something about him, glorifying. Guru was there, but that Guru gone, vanished. Bhakti Mahatma wrote, the writing is there with me. If you like to see, I can show. Guru was there, but that Guru vanished. Same Siddhanta. When Mahaprabhu is standing in front of Brahmananda Bharati. Hey, where is Brahmananda Bharati? Where is Brahman? Here you are. That useless. He cannot become. He cannot be Brahmananda Bharati. Mahaprabhu is standing in front of Brahmananda Bharati. And ask him, Gundo, where is Brahmananda Bharati? Here you are. That useless. He can, how he can become Brahmananda Bharati? How Brahmananda Bharati can wear tiger skin? That's when Mahaprabhu wanted to put some objection. You are wearing tiger skin to prove your glory. But those who are devotees, they are going to show Yukta Vairagya. They are not going to show. I can put coat and pen everything in tie to speak in front of foreign devotee. After that I can come. And wear. That's why I wear red cloth. Why? Because I have my right. To preach, I can do. But those who are having already sannyas, they cannot wear white dress. Those who are already having sannyas, they have no right to wear white dress. They cannot do. But I can wear for preaching purpose. Otherwise, they can sew. I see, Babaji. They. They are so clever, like jackal, they want to put me in the same category like Sahaja Babaji. So I like to at least express that here is one lion. The son of lion is lion. The grandson of lion is also lion. Grandson of lion cannot become jackal. Remember this point. Try to remember this point. Don't forget. That's why I'm wearing So, Bhakti Muntagu writing so many things. But before taking initiation, Bhakti Muntagu, he himself wrote, well, Guru was there, but the Guru vanished. It can so happen. Immediately, Brahmananda Bharati going to throw the tiger skin and going to wear one cloth and come. Here you are, Brahmananda Bharati. I paid under you are my guru. Because Guru Varga, na? Brahmananda is Guru Varga. Ah, you are my guru. When Mukunda speaking, Brahmananda Bharati coming in Nilachal. Where? Really? Yes, Brahmananda is coming. So, we can, I can bring Brahmananda Bharati here? I can bring, we can bring Brahmananda Bharati here in front of... No! His guru. I must go to him. You cannot bring to me. I must go to give honor to him. But you are speaking wrong. Mahaprabhu himself teaching. You cannot bring him in front of me. Rather, I can go to him with garland and everything to pay honor. That is the mood of Gauranga So what's wrong in it? What's wrong in it? When Prabhupada, Bhakti Mahatma told this way, what's wrong in it? All Siddhanta Bija. Bhakti Mahatma Thakur or Gaurgisar Baba or Prabhupada or Raguna, they need not take any initiation, but still they are taking. Nartham Thakur, all they are taking. By initiation, they are taking initiation. But Bhakti Mahatma Thakur ultimately wanted to prove that I am in Bhagavad Parampara. That's the same thing I explained in my writing and speech. Though Bhakti Mahatma Thakur is all eternal person of Gauranga. But still, for our, you know, satisfaction, he wanted to prove that now I am in Bhagavad Parampara. Now I am in Bhagavad Parampara. Because the bridge is broken. The bridge is broken. So, the bridge is broken, how I can cross? Broken, okay. You can make one through Bhagavad Parampara. There is one of the bridge. Because Bhagavad Parampara is more practical. 
This way, I already proved Bhakti Mahatma Thakur wanted to give us, Bhakti Mahatma Thakur already given us Guru, all books, all invaluable books. After that, Guru Dham Granthadam, Namadam Harinam, how to do? Harinam? Writing Harinam Chintama, everything. Namadam Dhamadam. Another name of Bhakti Minut Thakur is Nodiya Prakas. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Bhakti Minut Thakur, another name of Bhakti Minut Thakur is Nodiya Prakas. He wanted to expose. He wanted to show the glories of Nodiya Bihari Gauranga. He wanted to express. That's why another name of Bhakti Minut Thakur is Nadia Prakash. It is he who wanted to expose Mayapur Dham, these, that, so many things. We have all documents. By the help of Hunter, one foreigner, he was the government service holder, engineer. Bhakti Thakur, while staying at district magistrate, wanted to consult with him and he wanted to help him. This way we can make one design, I mean, of Navadip or Nodia. You know? Manchitra, grab of India, uh, I mean, grab of Nodia, I mean, grab of Mayapu. Nodia. He wanted to show where from river going, how river changed, how river in course of time changed track. This way, that land gone, that side, that land came. All Bhakti Mutter wanted to. I have the book. I have the book. Very old book. Chitre Navadip. Manchitra. Hmm? This way. So, Dhamadam, Bhakti Dham, Bhuri Dham Bande. He has given us devotion. If you can get in connection with Bhakti Minu Thakur, 100% I, I challenge you, I promise you, you can get Bhakti. Provided you are in touch with Bhakti Minu Thakur, in line. If you are derailed, you cannot get Bhakti. Some so-called devotees, they wanted to complain in front of Prabhupada. Well, you are so tough. Why? Bhakti Tagore already allowed the Sahaja Kirtan, uh, I mean, Pala Kirtan, everything. But you are so tough. Why you cannot allow? It was very more practical. Prabhupada speaking. Now Bhakti Tagore just gone. In the year of, I can discuss this point someday, when Tira Bhaktiti, now Abhir Bhaktiti, I can touch. Just go on Bhakti Mahatma Thakur. Now you are going to complain against me. And after that what will happen? After that what will happen? I don't know. Actually Bhakti Mahatma Thakur never wanted to allow the Sahajiya Kirtan. But he was bound to catch elephant by the help of woman elephant. Papa told, like one beautiful woman elephant, then elephant they are searching, they like to run to get the association. Then they are so clever, they are going to make a big cavity. Big cavity. Follow. And that lady elephant, I mean the female elephant, she is trained. She is going to move around this way. But the male element, why should I take trouble to a side? Better I can go straight and to catch. They're going there, they become, they discover themselves in a trap. They fall down. This way Bhakti Mantu wanted to make some trap. This way Bhakti Mantu wanted to make some trap by the help of which he can catch all mad elephant, I mean all mad jivatma, crazy jivatma, 
and by giving his own darshan, he is sitting in the kirtan. Bhakti Mandir was sitting and doing doing Hari Nam, closing eyes. Everybody is thinking he is also here in kirtan. Bhakti Mandir sitting here, and those kirtan, Sahaja kirtan here. Everybody is thinking Bhakti Mandir also here in kirtan, but Bhakti Mandir pass away. To Brindavan is not here. He is doing Hari Nam. Everybody coming and watching Bhakti Mandir. At least by paying pranam, they are getting some advantage. Because darshan ne pravitra karo ei to margun. By giving darshan only, Vaishnav can purify me. Whereas I need to go to Ganga, touch Ganga, then I can become pure. Whereas by giving darshan, Vaishnav can purify. So Bhakti Mata is going to adopt one very nice tricky procedure. Tricky procedure, by the help of which at least he can arrange some mangal for those crazy jivatmas. That is the point. You think Bhakti Mata is hearing, but if you go through all the writings, all the writings of Bhakti Mata, you saw Ho Sahajiya Gaudiya devotee. Ho Sahajya Gauriyamat Acharya Gauriya Devoti. Can you show me one, one single instant by the help of which you can prove Bhakti Mena Thakur was in favor of Sahajya? You wanted to get some love puja very quickly. That's why you adopted that kind of procedure. But you don't know you are going to arrange your going to hell forever with your followers. You forget this point. You forget this point. Each and every step you open, life is very short. I like to discuss, I like to discuss Jaiva Dharma, I like to so many things. But how time? Gita already done. In Hindi, I have no time. Life is very short when I can go away from this material world. No time to discuss one one sastra, triple time, four time in different languages. And now, Due to Maya, you all are going away, leaving this golden opportunity. I don't know what kind of bad luck waiting for you. I forecast. You are going to kick out this golden opportunity. You are sitting in the lap of Guru Vaishnava. You like to kick them out and go to jump into fire. You yourself can discover. We are going to destroy all bhajan, all our nice procedure. You like to break and go. Because when karma coming, when karma develop, na, then you cannot hear the advice of Gauranga himself. If Gauranga himself coming, you cannot hear. If karma develop, na, if karma develop, then you cannot hear the advice of even Gauranga You have to jump into fire. So let me see what happens. Bhagwan is there. Can I arrange? I'm very sorry. Even after giving so much blood, whole blood of my body, I given. But still, I cannot help you to come out of trap. Some of them coming already. My blood can never go in vain. I don't believe. So, so this way, Bhakti Mahatma Thakur wanted to arrange everything. All arrange. You can go through all the writings. Even on single instant can also. Rather, I can show you, Bhakti Mahatma writing, you should start non-cooperation movement with those Sahaji Acharyas. They are going to mislead you. Many writings, Bhakti Mahatma writing. Everywhere Bhakti Mahatma Even Rasatattva you go, Bhakti Mahatma going to pray unto the lotus feet of Personified rasa. Oh rasa, please excuse me. Please bless me. Rasa in personified form. Bhakti Mandu watching. Please bless me. So, material rasa also can come in your life in personified form. But it is shadow. It is like shadow. Can come in the form of money, position, everything. In personified form. You are getting no? Pratishtha, La Puja Pratishtha. Everybody giving garland to you, washing on lotus feet. Though you are a fallen soul, it's a golden opportunity. 
So in personified, we can see the Pratishtha. How much money you gathered, how much position, is all personified form. Or can come in the form of some beautiful lady or a handsome man. Who knows in which form Mayadavi can say? No guarantee. Anytime. So, it's very dangerous. Anyway, today is the Abhir Bhaktiti of Sila Sachidanda Bhakti Thakur. We wanted to discuss so many things from different, different angles. But time is limited. We are expressing deep concern about the situation prevailing at present. Nothing to do. Finally, I would like to say that Sri Sachidanda Bhakti Thakur sitting at the bank of Saraswati, praying to Bhagavan that I am sitting here to get Brajarasa, whereas he already having Brajarasa. He already having Brajarasa. Suro Sarid Upakanthe Godrume Gauru Tirthe Basati Sisuro Vikunje Bhakti Purvam Binadaha Jugalo Charano Shoksho Lava Saya Aso Padupad Padapadmasray Atro. Padapadmasray Atro. I am sitting here, partaking center of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, to get that rasa, jugal rasa. Padapadmasray Atro. So, Gurudam, Granthadam, Namadam, Dhamadam, Muda. Bhakti dam bhuri dam bande bhakti binodakam sada vanchakal padrasik basin pati tanang pavan bhavishnu si si dhant saraspati vijayate gauri agosti pati